birthday, it's your birthday. <웃음> 호랑이와 대화하며 수술을 성공적으로 마친 두리틀. 그 수술이 알려지면서 두리틀은 사람들과 동물들에게 인기가 많아졌고 하루하루 바쁘게 보내고 있었습니다. <웃음> Hey, baby, how you doing? A date with who? I didn't ask. She's a big girl now, John. Well, we'll see about this date thing. Uh, where's the birthday girl at? Uh, she's unreachable. What do you mean she's unreachable? Where is she? She's in her room with the door locked and headphones on. You could try paging her. She's in the house and she's unreachable in the house with a headphone. I'm supposed to page her in my house. Be careful, Doc. She's 16. That's a tough age. Hey, Sharice, open this door. Can you even leave this? Hey! Try her cell. I'm not calling on the cell phone while she's in her bedroom. Those teenagers, Doc, they can drive a man to drink. Hey, what are you drinking? Gatorade. Oh, really? Give it to me. Hmm. Gatorade make wine now, huh? Which one of you is Doolittle? What now? I have a message from the boss. From the who? The boss, the God Beaver. Now save the questions and come with me. Look, you guys know the rules. You just don't come up here on my balcony. Make an appointment. You make an appointment. Now go, you tell the beaver make an appointment, just like everybody else. Talk. This is Daddy, how are you? Hey! Hey, I got a couple of questions for you. I want to know how come I got to climb up the side of yes, a building yes, and get on a cell phone to talk to you Dad, in your where bedroom. Are you? Dad, Dad, what are you doing? What? What am I doing because it's the only way I can reach you? What are you doing in here? What's all of this? What's all of that about? You don't do that in public, do you? Dance? Of course. That's not dancing, that's advertising. What's this about you don't want to spend your birthday with your family? Dad, having dinner with your family is something you do when you're young. Now when you're turning 16. Besides, I have a date. Well, you can bring your date with you because you're coming to dinner. Well, Eric, these are my parents and my little sister. They're going to be joining us on our date. No, he's going to be joining us at a family event. Sharice, we have it every year. I don't even know why... What's this? Dad, th that's private. I can see why it's private. It's embarrassing, Sharice. You got two C's and a D on here. Embarrassing? Dad, you are the last person who should be talking about anything being embarrassing. Now, what are you talking about? What's that supposed to mean? <laughs> oh, so I'm supposed to stop doing what I do, stop doing my work, and stop helping the animals because you find it embarrassing? That's not gonna happen. That's right, it's not gonna happen, so forget about it. You're coming to dinner. Look at this. No cell phone for a week. Biggie Mac cell. Biggie Mac pager. Biggie Mac home. Who the hell is Biggie Mac? I don't know, John. Hello? Hey, who is this? Well, who is this? Is this Biggie Mac? Who wants to know? Hey, I'm asking the questions here, punk. What? How old are you? None of your damn business. Oh, really? What if I make it my business to find out how old you are? Are you threatening me? No, I don't make threats. I'm promising you that if you ever... John, is this John Doolittle? Hi, I'm so sorry. That's a wrong number. It's not. That's a grown man that's on the other than that phone. I wish I could say the same thing about you. 딸 샤리스의 생일날 초대된 남자친구 에릭. 두리틀은 에릭이 마음에 들지 않았지만 샤리스 때문에 꾹 참으며 같이 저녁 식사를 합니다. Uh, I don't think you want to go down that road, my friend. All right, look, you go and tell the beaver. Eight o'clock, my office tomorrow. Oh, the beaver don't travel for nobody. He knows you're a busy man, and he will remember this. But this is truly a life or death situation. My car, 7 a.m. in the morning, all right? Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday. Happy birthday, dear Cherie. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday to you. Surprise! Happy birthday! It's your birthday. 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 It's
birthday. It's your birthday. There's a mouse in the house. Sharice, I'm so sorry. Ooh, ooh, ouch. Hey, hey, watch the fur. Watch the fur, buddy. We're trying to do something nice for your daughter. I bet if a cute little kitty popped out, you'd say, oh, how cute, how cute. You, but you're not. You're not. You're, you're not a couple of, Listen, you're not a couple of cute little kitties. Yes, we are. You're two disgusting rats. No, we're not. They just ruined the birthday cake. Oh, so you want to get personal now, don't you? Well, you know what rats spell backwards is, mister? It's star. That's right. I'm a star, buddy. Oh, really? Is that right? Well, do you know what high spells backwards? No, I don't have a... Star! Ah! Exactly! <laughs> Good be. Hey, Sharice, look, I'm sorry about tonight. Okay, I'm thinking about cutting back a little bit and spending some more time around here with you guys. Great, now more animals will be here. What if we don't stay here? We can go on a big vacation to Europe, the whole family. What about that? Are you serious? I'm dead serious. We can go to Paris, Rome, the Greek islands. We always talked about that. Let's do it. What do you think? Is this a bribe? Yes, this is a bribe. <laughs> it's working. 다음 날 아침 두리틀은 자신의 찾아온 동물들과 같이 자신을 기다리고 있는 숲의 대장을 만나러 갑니다. Yeah, Doctor Doolittle, I presume. Welcome to my den. Would you like a fish? Oh, no, thank you. I've eaten already. I've heard good things about you from some of the Bay Area families. What do you guys want from me? Well, I'm losing my territory. What, the other animals moving in on you or something? Yeah, the human kind. They're cutting down our homes, busting up families. Where it is, they're cutting down a whole forest. Okay, guys, you're talking to the wrong person. You need to contact one of those nature groups, like uh, the Sierra Club or... Um... It has to be you, Doc. You're the only one who knows how to speak human. 비버의 말을 듣고 문제가 되고 있는 장소로 간 두리틀. 두리틀은 그곳에서 인간들의 욕심 때문에 파괴된 숲을 보고 할 말을 잃습니다. It's gone. Everything gone. How do you save a forest anyway? You know it's not going to be easy, John. I would assume the lumber companies have a lot of clout. But I do know if there were a threatened or an endangered species living in the forest, there definitely are laws that protect it. Or well, you found an endangered species, a bear, a female whose mother had been killed by poachers. She's the only Pacific Western bear up there. Well, that's good. One bear has to be protected, right? Well, no, the uh, lawyers for Potter's Logging Company argued that since she's the only one up there, there's no chance for survival of the species anyway. There'd have to be a male, too. Pardon me? Why don't we just get a male up there, get the two of them together, and let nature take its course? Well, unfortunately, the only male Pacific Western bear that we could find was raised in captivity, Excuse and there's me? never been a bear raised in captivity that's been successfully reintroduced to the wild. They've never had the world-famous love doctor make any introductions. Doctor? Excuse me, sir. Your man left the barn door open. Something wrong? Oh, uh, dude. Uh, oh, jeez. Don't get... Bam, bam, didn't see that. No, I'm sure. The yeah. giraffe is the one that was disgusted. I right? am so sorry. I know you're really disappointed. Disappointed? About not going to Europe? Now, Dad, why would I be disappointed? I made you a promise I'm going to stick to it. If you don't want me to do this, I'll understand. Okay. Or I can actually say no and not feel guilty for the rest of my life. When do we leave? As soon as we can get a court order stopping the clear cutting. Who's going to argue the case? What? Why are you looking around? Me? No, Your Honor. We're simply asking for an injunction so that we might have the chance to save a species. Your Honor, this is a delaying tactic slash publicity stunt saving a species. I have affidavits signed by a range of experts who all concur that to take a a bear raised in captivity and reintroduce it into the wild is, well, dangerous and irresponsible. Simply put, a bear raised by circus folk wouldn't know how to feed itself or interact with real bears, let alone make it through its first winter. No, it would certainly succumb to Darwin's law of nature, survival of the fittest. Actually, well, yeah, but Darwin's never met my dad. Young lady, that's inappropriate behavior. And just who is your father? Sir, uh, Your Honor, that's me. I'm her father. Name's Doolittle. Dr. Doolittle. Do you feel you could rehabilitate a tame bear and mate it in the wild with a female? Yes, I do, Your Honor. Well, in that case, I'll grant a one month's delay on the harvesting of Campbell's Grove. Thank you, sir. And doctor, if that bear should so much as set one paw in a campsite or this town, I'll rescind this order immediately. I understand completely. Thank you, Your Honor. Thank you. 재판이 끝나고 두리틀은 숲에 살고 있는 멸종 위기의 곰과 같은 종의 곰이 있는 서커스장으로 찾아갑니다. Big bone gal, huh? Yeah, I guess so. You got any action shots? 
You know what I'm talking about. No, I don't, but listen, you'd be really lucky to wind up with somebody like her. Oh, look, I have had so many girlfriends. <laughs> you know, okay, look, I've never had a girlfriend, but just bring her by. Bring her by on Monday. That's when I'm dark, okay? Oh, no, 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 I can't bring her here. You have to go to her. Whoa, 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 go to her? Where? Um, she's in the forest. What I'm proposing to you is I'd like to take you back to where your ancestors roamed, get you out in the woods and teach you to be a real bear. Look, I like the bear I am, okay? I'm famous. You do this, I promise you'll be the most famous bear in all the world. Bigger than Pooh. Governor, I've got two lumber mills waiting for that wood. I understand, Joe, but it's complicated. Especially if that endangered bear survives. I don't meet my quota, Governor. You're the one who's going to be endangered. 숲을 지키기 위해 두리틀과 그의 가족들은 유럽 여행을 미루고 숲으로 들어갑니다. Do 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 do. Well, this looks like as good a place as any here. Here we go. Ah, the simple pleasures of life. Holy Lord, that wolf is a fox. Oh, you like that, huh? Yeah, that was me. <laughs> Play more where that came from, if you know what I mean. What is that? Some kind of secret wild lady dog code for you like me? Yeah, I do some dancing. Here's a little move I call the back scratcher. Pretty cool, huh? Hey, hey, hot lady dog. Wait, where are you going? Call me. So dirty. Look at my paws. Yes, it's the woods, Archie. Its chief component is dirt. Wait, hey, dog, is that her? She's a babe. I'll tell you what. I'm gonna go over and introduce you. You just wait here, okay? Yeah, good. Hey, tell her I really dig her fat pouch, but don't be crude. Oh, are you coming over here? I'm a little busy <clears throat> foraging. Hi. Hi. Hello, um, my name is John. I'm Ava. That's a pretty name, Ava. Nice to meet you. Hi. Hey, a, a quick question, Ava. How would you like to meet the man of your dreams? You're real cute, but I don't go interspecies. Oh, no. <laughs> I'm not talking about me. I'm talking about, I shouldn't have said man. Oh. I should have said bear. How would okay. you like to meet the bear of your dreams? Look at that big, what do you think of that big, magnificent hunk of bear over there? Um. Oh, is he standing behind that door? Look, let me explain to you what's going on, all right? There's a logging company that's going to tear down this whole forest, everything. Oh. And the only thing that can stop them is if I can get two Pacific Western bears together. You're a Pacific Western bear, and so is he. And if I can get the two of you together, and you made little Pacific Western bears, then you see where I'm going with this? Uh-huh, yeah. Look, no offense, but I don't talk to bear pimps. Hey, wait a minute. Come on. At least let me call him over so you can meet him, please. Archie, come over here. OK, Archie, you're on. What do I say to her? Get to know her a little bit. Tell her a little about yourself. Hi, I'm Archie. I like moonlit walks on the beach, uh, sharing slop buckets with that special someone, and uh, soulful sounds of the Backstreet Boys. You're very weird. Weird as in sexy? No, just weird. So, Ava, what do you think of Archie? Cute, huh? I need a real bear. Someone who can hunt and protect and provide for me. Oh, and you know, I'm already involved with someone. Really? You have a boyfriend already? A bear friend? Yeah. Are you in love with this bear? Love? Look, my cousin married for love, and the next thing she knows, he's two-timing her with this hot little grizzly in a cave up north. Okay, so you're not in love? No. All right, let's make a deal. Don't make any decisions for a month. I'm gonna go work with Archie. In a month's time, I'm gonna turn that bear into a bear that you will be proud to have little bear cubs with, okay? Mm, perfect night. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Sitting out here breathing this fresh country air and just listening to the crickets chirp. Yep. It seems a little cold out here, doesn't it? Yeah, yeah, a little nippy. Maybe I need to go get my vest. 유럽은 아니지만 가족들과 있는 것이 좋았던 두리틀. 행복해하던 두리틀 앞에 샤리스의 남자친구인 에릭이 등장합니다. Hey! Hey! You love your homie! Wait, uh, Sharice, uh, I don't understand. What's not there to understand? It? Um, Eric with bags, I don't understand that. Well, he's staying here for a couple of nights. Mama said so. There's our opportunistic eaters finding food wherever they can. There's can we please see what else is on? No, we can't see what else is on. You need to watch this, Archie, so you can learn how to feed yourself and survive during the winter. Tomorrow morning, we're gonna get up at the crack of dawn, and I'm teaching you how to fish. All right, Archie, let's do it. This river's full of fish. Let's go. Yup, so is Red Lobster. Hey, don't look at me. Look at the water. That's where the fish are. They're moving. Oh, man. Why don't you touch me? Why don't you touch me? It's Archie. Oh, what's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? Oh, oh, what's up? Archie. Hey. Archie. Archie. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh. Oh. Okay, Archie. Now you tell me how smart you have to be to lift your head up out of the water when you can't breathe. Okay, that's it. We're gonna take you on a little trip right now that's gonna toughen you up. Come on. What? Okay, am I close? Cold. Use the force. So how's it going? 
I think it's going great. I'm not even gonna need three weeks. Honey, look, he's already foraging grapes, right? I uh, getting dizzy. Hey, pop! <웃음> 많은 노력을 했지만 아직 숲에 적응하지 못한 아치. 그 모습을 지켜보던 두리틀은 아치를 데리고 벌목으로 인해 삶의 터전을 잃은 동물들에게 찾아갑니다. Meanwhile, the doctor gave Archie and me some lessons of our own. Could you leave a little for me? Because technically it is my... <laughs> Just a thought. Hey, so what's going on here? I've been so blessed, I feel I should give back to the hot lady dog. No, look, you don't have to put up with that. Hey, get out of here. Ah, no. Ah! That is one hot fox. What's the matter with you two? What? Don't you know that every female is looking for the strongest male? But what about personality? I'm gonna die a virgin. The strongest male is called the alpha male. Now, the alpha male is the big boss. He wants everybody to know he's the boss male. You have to be him, the boss of all the males. The alpha male, you have to learn how to, how, to, how to walk like the alpha male. Walk the walk. Walk the walk. That's right, and talk to alpha male, talk. Yeah, I'm still on the walk. That's right, it's about power and respect. It's about pure, unchecked, uncompromised, testosterone-driven male power. John, didn't I ask you to line the garbage pails? Hey, you line them your damn self, woman! What? I'm, I'm, so, I'm sorry, honey, I was talking to the animals. I got a little riled up. I was teaching them something. <laughs> How could anybody be so beautiful? Why don't you go down there and tell her that? Uh, I don't know. I, oh, my. What is that? Oh, that's Sonny. That's her little bear friend. She told me about him. But he's a Kodiak bear. They don't get discouraged, man. Listen, you can win her over. But the key to winning a woman over is just figure out what she likes. Hey, baby. Hi. <laughs> What's wrong with your voice? You're looking mighty fine. So, why don't you plant some of that sugar over here on my, on Archie, the truly... Oh, oh no. Is that our song? Oh. <laughs> oh. Ow! Hard ground back. You should maybe learn how to climb trees. Truly. Hey, come on out of there, Archie. Never! I'm sure it wasn't that bad. It was the most humiliating thing I've ever done. And I once rode a unicycle in a tutu. A tutu! <laughs> All right, Archie. I'm not playing anymore. I want you to come out here right now, you big coward. Uh, excuse me. Who are you calling a coward? You. I'm calling you a coward. You're a big coward for quitting like this. Oh, Ava laughed at me. Oh, boo-hoo. Ava laughed at me. I love her and I need her. She laughed at me. You know something you don't even deserve, Ava. Why should Ava have to spend the rest of her life with a coward like you? Hey, don't poke the bear, buddy. Well, I didn't poke a bear, because if I poked a bear, a bear would be mauling me. So I don't know what I poked, but it sure as hell ain't no bear. Hey, I'm warning you. Oh, yeah, and I'm poking you. Hey, stop it. Uh, and poke, poke, poke. All right, that's it. Uh, uh, Archie hurt. A bear. Woohoo! I'm a bear! I'm the alpha bear! Grr! Grr! Bear say grr, right? What happened to you? Archie! I... you know... Uh, Potter called. He wants to make a deal. Just listen to what he has to say. Ooh, so for you, madame. Thanks. So does Sonny bring you fish? No, not a fish. Usually about a hundred. But does Sonny tell you that you have the most beautiful eyes he's ever seen? Does he promise to fill your life with love, poetry, laughs? No. And, you know. No, mostly he just asks me when I think I'll be in heat. <laughs> <laughs> Prince Charming, huh? Yeah. <laughs> so when, it, when is that? <laughs> Do you want to go for a walk? With you or alone? <laughs> with me. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Hey, now you listen to me. Yeah, that's right. You're in my house now. Yeah, my house. Hey, you're a lucky girl, you know that? Yeah, you're the lucky one, not me. You. Hey, hey, you want to go out with me tonight, or would that be good, or? Hey, wait a minute. What do you think you're doing? 
Who, 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 me? No, I'm not doing anything. I'm just, you know, assuming the position. Hey, you marked my tree. Oh, no, I would never do that. I would never mark, uh, mark your tree. I don't even know what those words mean. I drank a lot of water. I'll tell you something about water. It goes right through me. Come on, it smells like lemonade. Oh, yeah, oh, I see your point. Yeah, yours is very, very strong. It's like, like ammonia. I'm actually getting dizzy, to tell you the truth. Yeah. You know, bears have died trying to reach that height. Well, if you want it, you got it. Oh, please, don't even think about it. That's not funny. No, I'm gonna go get it for you. No, Archie, I'm serious. Don't. It's too dangerous. Okay. Promise me. Okay. I like you, Ava. I like you too, Archie. Oh, what are you girls doing over here? Sunny, don't. Beat it, circus boy. Sunny. Oh, you keep your yap shut. Hi, <laughs> your charm is matched only by your odor. And what does that mean? Oh, it just means you're a malodorous ignoramus. It's nothing really. What is he saying? Well, I'm confused. I don't like being confused. Let's go, Ava. I'm trying to confuse Ava, me. don't go. Look, maybe you can do better than me, but don't do worse. I thought you liked me. Of course I do. Come on, Ava. But you'll always be a city bear, and I need more than that. City bear. Great. 둘이 틀은 협상하기 위해 포털을 만납니다. This bear you brought up here has as much likelihood of making little bear babies as Riley here. Ain't it gonna happen. On the other hand, thanks to you, I'm not exactly drowning in favorable publicity. So, here's my offer. I will set aside 10 acres, turn it into a sanctuary. You can bring all your little animal buddies there. Plus, you'll be saving face. You won't have to admit you'd failed. You, you don't look like a fool. Look, 10 acres is ridiculous. That's the offer. The deadline is Wednesday at 12 noon. Let me be clear, at 12.01, we'll be sending in every logger, every piece of logging equipment we've got. By Friday, there won't be a tree standing. I need to run this by my wife. Ooh, 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 ooh. Hey, Johnny. Get out. What are you doing? Doc, I know what to do. I've got my big finish. Look, come in here, quick. All right. Hey, I don't think I'm allowed in here. Okay, listen, I gotta tell you, this thing is over. I'm just sorry I dragged you into all of this. I'm gonna have to get you an audition in Vegas or something, you know, because these guys offer me a deal, and it's the best I can do. No, 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 the best you can do is not give up on me, Doc. Come on, you told me. Listen to your inner bear, remember? I don't know, Archie. Look, I know how I can win Ava! Okay, I know I'm nuts or something, but I'm gonna give it another shot. I'll give it one more chance. Yes! Okay, let me get over. Yes! <laughs> Gentlemen, uh, no deal. Thanks for your time. Can you hear me, Pupito? Stop staring at me. You're giving me a complex. I'm trying to blend. Well, if you can hear me, can you change to the color of this table? What do you think you're doing? I think he understands me. Well, if he understood me, I'd tell him how sick I am of all these stupid animals. <gasps> oh, that really hurt. Well, if you could understand me, i tell you to do something about those dander flakes. It's looking like Christmas in July. I hate this place. So young, so angry. Damn that rap music. So, how'd it go? Well, I told Potter no deal. Well, I thought it wasn't working with Archie. Well, Archie's got an idea. He thinks he can win Ava over, so I'm gonna see this thing through. So that means we're stuck here? Oh, Cherise. Hey, Cherise. Hey. We're not getting along too good, are we? I want to go home. I want to go home, too. We're going home, but there's something else that's bothering you, isn't it? I'm not saying it's all your fault. Maybe it's my fault. I don't know. Maybe it's a phase of something that you're going through, but something's bothering you, OK? And your mother thinks you got a problem, and you're not telling us about it. No. You sure? There's nothing bothering you? I'm sure. OK, now, because you know I'm not saying you do have a problem, but if you do have a problem, we always we work things out, right? Right. You cool? Cool. Dad? Yes. Yes. I knew it. I knew something was bothering you. What is it? Come on, talk to me. It must be the mountains messing me up, because I'm fine. <laughs> She's all right. You have your little space. I'll be in the house. All right. OK. He's going after the hive. He's going after the hive. Who? Archie. Who? Archie, you idiot. Jeez. So this is your big plan, huh? Archie, you get back here right now. Come back in. No way, Doc. I'm going to do this or die trying. Archie, what are you doing? What's going on around here? Oh, Circus Boy's got a new trick. Quiet, Sonny. OK. Oh, oh, oh. Don't move, Archie. Don't move. Careful, careful. I'll buy you the honey. Oh, 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 oh. Hey, oh, 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 oh. Get down. I'm fine. Oh, oh. There are bees. Oh, I'm trying to talk to him. Work something out. Don't you move. Attack! Oh, no, 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 no
아치의 용감한 모습을 보고 반한 에바는 소니와 헤어집니다. Like, honey? Yeah, babe, what's up? No, I meant would you like more honey? Oh no, I'm good. Okay. So, you ready to talk about preserving the species? Well, we could talk, or you could count to a hundred and come and get me. Okay, counting is great. One, two, three. It's impressive. He's really counting. Come on, focus, focus. Uh, one, two, three, ten, uh, fifteen. Okay, one hundred. Ow! What the nap? What is it? What happened? It's Archie. Okay, folks, let's move it back now. We got a wild animal coming through. Excuse me, I'm Dr. Doolittle. What happened in here? Oh, well, he broke down the back door, and then we found him ransacking the kitchen. No. Hey, Archie, it's me. What happened? Hey, I was so close, Doc. It came out of nowhere. And I... Are you ready to save the forest? The good news is we're setting aside 10 acres of forest. We're calling it the Dr. Doolittle Wildlife Sanctuary. Very pleased about that. Ah, speak Dr. of the devil. Little, can we ask you a few questions? You know, you think you won this thing, Randall, but you haven't. Fine. We'll just level your forest and call it a tie. Only I had an eyewitness. Did anybody see what happened? Yeah. We got one problem. He's a friggin' weasel. Hey, well, Mr. Weasel, did you see what happened to the bear? Ooh, the big scary bear. Did I see what happened? Did to you the... see anything or not? Okay, here's the deal. You give me that shiny wristwatch of yours, and I'll tell you what you need to know. He's such a weasel. Oh, thank you. How does people set Archie up? I got a witness. An animal? You can't offer that to evidence. Well, you got any better ideas? Well, I'll, I'll stall for time. Maybe we'll get a private investigator. John, if you go on the witness stand, Riley is going to tear you to shreds. Well, what do I have to lose? Your reputation. Look, I don't care. I'm not giving up on those animals this easy. Not without a fight. Excuse me. Your Honor, we admit it was a setback, but we would like one more week to rehabilitate the bear. Might I suggest perhaps counsel would like to uh, admit the animal into the Betty Ford Clinic? What if I could prove the entire thing was a setup? That would be a very serious allegation. Do you intend to present evidence? We have an eyewitness. Is that witness here in the courtroom? No, in that in the courtroom with us because um, he's uh, he's a weasel. <laughs> Order. Your Honor, I know this, this seems very unreasonable, but I can talk to animals, and one of them did come forward with this information, sir. Dr. Doolittle, I will not allow you to make a mockery of my courtroom. The deadline has passed. Motion to extend denied. 재판이 끝나고 두리틀은 아치에게 재판 결과를 알려줍니다. Yeah. What? They sold you to a Mexican circus. Hey, Chihuahua. Archie, I am... I'm so sorry. For what? For everything. You know, dragging you out here and putting you through all this stuff. Giving you hope. I feel like I ruined your life. Ruined my life? <laughs> Doc, you gave me a life. You're the one who taught me about love. And no one can ever take that away from me. Hey, Sharice. What are you doing down here? Mom wanted me to tell you that her motion for an appeal has been denied. We knew it was a long shot anyway. Well, Archie, at least you'd be back in show business. Yeah, that's not what I want anymore. I just want Ava. Maybe I wasn't meant to be loved. Everybody is meant to be loved. That's right. Everybody is meant... Sharice. Sharice, since when? A couple of weeks now. At first, it was kind of fuzzy, but uh, now it's really clear. <laughs> and this is what you've been keeping from us, right? I didn't want to say anything, Dad, because I didn't want to become a freak. Oh, no, you're not going to become a freak. Not at all. <laughs> hey, look, when it started happening to me, I got scared, too. Just looking at it the wrong way, this is a good thing. How? Well, look at all the good that's come out of it already. What good? Well, look at us, like this, huh? How about this, huh? Mm. <laughs> Dad, you gotta help him. Isn't there something that we can do? And it's not just him. I mean, it's all the animals. There's so many of them. Yeah, there are so many of them. 
샤리스의 말에서 힌트를 얻은 두리틀은 숲에 있는 동물들에게 같이 힘을 모아 이 상황을 헤쳐나가자고 말합니다. I'm serious. Whenever people talk about the best of the best, is always an animal expression. You got a heart like a lion, or he's as strong as an ox. He's got eyes like an eagle, or he can move swift like a gazelle, or you stink like a skunk. What? Hey, kids, we got to ask you to move. No. No? Listen, don't start with me. Everybody, take your positions. <laughs> Hasta la vista, baby. None of them have any milk. What? What's wrong, Annabelle? Strike! 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 Here's your egg. You want a scramble? Strike! Strike! It's ridiculous. Animals can't organize. I'm sure I'm going to regret this in the morning, but maybe you should talk with Doolittle. And what? Give in to a bunch of beasts and lower life forms? I took on the Democrats, I can take on a bunch of animals. We have two bogeys bearing Alpha, Tango, Minor. We are locked on target, Spongebob. There's something. Commence bombing. Sir? Don't make any sudden moves. Gotcha. <laughs> I think you should run. I'm an attorney. I was. Yeah. I'm, I'm, not, I'm not with him. Not the face! <laughs> no, please. No, no. I'm sure we, we can work something out. Oh, whoa, oh, oh. whoa. No sudden movements or I'm going to bite you in the cannolis. Uh, hello. Uh, the number for Dr. John Doolittle, please. Oh, Mr. Potter. How are you, sir? Oh, I could be better. I'm here with uh, a couple of your friends. Well, I know you can't possibly believe that animals are organizing. Uh, well, you know, I don't know what to think anymore. I'll tell you what, let's put our cards on the table. I will be more than happy to set up a meeting between you and these animals so you can work out your problem. First off, let me say that I'm here only as a mediator, and these negotiations will be between Mr. Potter and the representatives of the United Animals of the Forest Local 534. This is my new proposal. What's the stipulations, Doc? What kind of territory are we looking at? It's only uh, 12 acres here. I got you 12 acres right here, pal. Hey, they like it. I'll give you something you like, like this. I think that's a no. 말도 안 되는 협상안으로 인해 협상이 부결된 상황. 동물들은 더욱 힘을 모아 단합하게 됩니다. 이 상황을 지켜보고 있던 포터는 심리적 압박을 받게 되고 결국 동물들에게 행복하게 됩니다. Mr. Pat, I hope we have a deal now. Let me phrase it this way. <sighs> you too, huh? Oh, come on. Cheer up, Pepito. You'll get it eventually. No, I won't. I will never blend in. I have a broken blender. You will blend in. Trust me. You will blend in. How? How will Pepito ever blend in? Pepito sucks. Oh, look at me. I'm blending in. I'm invisible. That's right. You're invisible. Great job, honey. Did you ever doubt me? 지금까지 영화 닥터 두리틀 2였습니다.